Hello. Don't let me drown. Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Hello, what's up? If you're new here, hi, hello. Why not hit the subscribe button down below? If you wanted help, you'd have seen a doctor by now. If you wanted help, you'd have gone to therapy by now. If you wanted help, you'd be on medication by now. I can't be the only one who's had someone say to them, if you wanted help, you'd have seen someone by now. I can't be the only one who's had someone say that to them. This was back when I lived in Lancashire. And I've got a whole video coming out very soon talking about Lancashire life. This video is about getting told that I wasn't trying to get help. To anyone who doesn't know, you can scroll back to my channel and see that every time I need help, I fight and fight and fight and fight until I give up. And then it's like, oh, let's offer an inpatient. So back when I lived in Preston, I was an, under a GP practice that didn't give you like a specific doctor. You see different doctors every time you went down, which was, it was crap, don't get me wrong. So I went to this GP appointment with this female doctor and I went because I was feeling suicidal. You know, funnily enough, I turned to the appointment, said, hey, my thoughts are getting really bad and I feel like acting on them, what should I do? And she turned around and said, if you want help you'd have tried to get it. If you wanted help you'd have tried to get it. A GP who was made aware that I was going to that appointment because I was suicidal because it was booked last minute. Not sure how to inform you of this. I went to that appointment to see someone. I ended up walking out of that appointment. I can remember it very vividly. I got up and just walked out. A day later I was sectioned and that happened in June. I want to talk a little bit because I've had like people online say this to me as well and they was like if you'd want help you'd accept what you're given or if you wanted help you'd go and see that. When the video is like me phoning like one on one or a crisis team to get support. Am I not trying to get help? What do you think? If I'm phoning like the crisis team in a video and they hang up on me, and then you come in. If you wanted to help, you'd ask for it. Believe me, picking up the phone in the first place was asking for the help. But hey, what do I know? But I've had friends say this to me as well. I, well, I say friends, they're very much so ex-friends. It was always like, oh, if you wanted help, you do. You go and see someone, you know, cured. You wouldn't be still be struggling all these years later. And at the time, I was really trying to get help. And this person was so unsupported and was actually the sole cause of some of the issues. Essentially, it was like, if you wanted help, you'd have got it. Like, why are you still struggling? Like, you don't have a reason to still be struggling. It's been five years. And like, it's not even that simple. Like, it's so hard to get help. Like, you have, to, like, especially in the UK, I don't know about everywhere else. It's so hard to access mental health services. And I've said this in a few videos, and videos where I've shown me trying to get help. How can I cope until I reach the top of the waiting list when right now I want it out? And like I said, it's hard to even pick up the phone for some people. My university, when I was in Lancashire at UCLan, the university was not the best at dealing with mental health. That's why I'm not in UCLan anymore because of how badly I got treated because of my mental health. I want to say this, if you've ever had anyone say that to you, literally take it as a pinch of salt. Don't let it get you down. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna end this little video, this little, I'm gonna end this little rambly video thing here because I feel like I've talked enough about it. I want to know your opinion, thoughts, and everything that you can think of about this subject. And subscribe! Give the subscribe button a bit of a whack. Hit the notification bell to be notified when I make a video every single day. And with that, I'm going to end the video here. Peace.